Hey everybody, it's Tyrol in episode 36 of Secret of Mana, and, uh, just picking chocolate out of my teeth. Anyway, I have finally got all their weapon levels to their respective levels. People from all over visit the ancient temple, and we're gonna see what this village has about. The mana tree grows in the Pierland. It's watching over us. Sure it is. Hey look, it's Watts. Phew, that's some climb, huh? Uh, we, we didn't climb. No. But everything's still done. So we don't need to do anything there. What do you have to say? Enjoy our lovely town. Chalk and his disciple Jack live on the peak. That's the person we have to go meet. But before we do that, we're going to explore the town. Because the town's really kind of cool. Monsters patrol the path of the peak. Hope say Jock's okay. I was impressed till you said you flew here. We, we did. We flew here on a dragon. And you will see that happen multiple times throughout this game. The Sage Jacques lives high up in the mountains. That girl always brings flowers. Well, that's good. What girl? Why are you wagging so bad? This temple dates from the Mana Fortress War. The orbs inside the store data from that period. The ancients called them, um, videos? <laughs> what are you, Spanish? <laughs> yes, that's what they're trying to get across. It's videos. Hi, have you come to meditate? Yep, that's what I come to do. Contemplate the world. Don't bug me while I'm thinking. Random voices. Random citizen voices. Om, om. <laughs> Alright, in the temple, which looks kind of like the ruins. There is a door in the back, I believe. Yes, there is, right there. But we're not going to do that yet. We're going to actually listen to these. Gazazz. Beep. Whoa, exploded. So that one doesn't work. This one's broken. There. You can see the mana beast. Just moments ago, it hit the fortress. Oh, it's coming this way. We're going off the... Sorry, it makes a lot of noise. We must restrict the use of mana to energy. What utter nonsense. We're using it up. Ha! You can't use up mana. Ha! You don't understand. So this has done happened before, as we already knew, but... Who was Abe Lincoln? Correct! That makes you our new champion! Little Jeopardy Easter egg. Evening news. At Ladon, Lorima launches missiles at the Empire which had threatened to take Lorima's capital by nightfall. I don't even know if Lorima still exists in this game, in this world. Oh, my heart breaks when she's not around and I miss her. Alright, that's enough of that. Again, I just kind of want to show you guys the neat little things here, little Easter eggs they put in here. And apparently we get weapons coming up through here, even though there's no thing to attack us. Saint Jacques will not see you unless you show you will overcome something to overcome. I didn't even read it. <laughs> How's that fair for playing a Let's Play? Nah, I didn't even feel like reading it. <sighs> Man, these weapon upgrades are taking forever, but at least the whip is now two levels away from being top tier. So, we're getting close. Mana sustains the cosmos, but it's not infinite. People no longer cherish, li cherish life, so mana is fading away. Well, that sucks. We're gonna spend a night at the inn, because I spent quite a number of spell points going up and down that mountain. You can see that we now have 545... We have half a million GP. I just went... Soon you'll see, but I went up and down this mountain range just, uh... Killing things to get that damn upgrade. And you can't get around this way, which is so irritating. Only way to get to the end is to come all the way around the town and go through the buildings. And, and we have already equipped. So we're going to go up to Sage Jacques. What's really funny is we're such a high level that these flowers here, these blue ones, these trap flowers, which of course are repainted, and the bombies are repainted as well. Uh. <laughs> cast Sleep Flower, but they can't hit 
any of our characters with it, because we're too high of a level. <laughs> and the only reason we're such a high level is because I keep trying to level up the weapons. Now, that cave we will be coming back to explore in a few minutes, but we're going to go see who we came here to see. Now, these are the creatures I've been killing, like, over and over. There, Sleep Flower, watch. Won't even work on me. I'm still awake. Haha. Uh -huh. The only problem with this trek is we need the whip a lot, which is kind of irritating because I like using the spear more. The spear is pretty powerful, as you can see. Stupid flower cells still get their damn spells off a lot. And then these are new enemy. I don't think we saw these before, but Agatris. Normally they are very powerful, but since we're oh god, hit it with one hit. Since we're such a high level and we're using leveled up weapons, we are freaking destroying this place. Alright, here's our first place. There's a way that you can actually glitch out the game I've seen in here to get all the way to the top fast, but I don't use it. You know, I'm just going to use a whip until we get to the top. Don't sleep me! Ugh. Can you see how annoying this area would be if we were actually low enough level to take the, that that spell. Cross we go! Stupid Agatris. Die. As we continue to assault the fortress of Mountain... I don't even know what this mountain's called. And that's pretty impressive. It's a level 5 sleep spell that's... Oh, there's Neko! Oh, you bitch. You weren't there before. Uh, we'll come back and see in a few... No, I don't want to go across! I just want to hit the damn bee. That's right, Navi. You hit it. Doug. Doug the Sprite. And people who get that reference are awesome. And old like me. <sighs> Alright, we finally made it up to this cave. Yay. Talk to me. Go away. The sage is out. What? Sage Jack went to the Palace of Darkness. You saw it on the way here. Oh. Well, we really didn't see a Palace of Darkness. However, we did see um, a cave. The fast way to get down the mountain is just to do this. Ha ha. Down we go. I think if we just land here, I think it's the spot. Yep. You cannot land on the top. You always have to climb, which is so annoying. Oh, where's my spear? I don't think we need the whip right away. These things also respawn new versions of itself, and it's called a fierce head. This is the first time we've come across these things, I believe. First time I've come across them in this let's play. Because I haven't come in here. Hey, look! Dark Knights. And we can't get through that door. Because it's closed. But we can go through here. Wait, could we go around that? I don't think we could. No. There's no point in killing that. You can't get to it. And this is just a dead end, but I am going to kill him. Because the fact of the matter is I wanted to. So, we can't go that direction. Let's go this way. Nope, that's where the door is. You won't even get a chance to use that weapon. We will destroy your face, Dark Ninja. Oh, we need to... You know, I'm just going to switch out to the sprite. Knock this stuff down. Wow. Embermen are pretty weak at this point. Uh, there is a way through there. We just can't get to it yet. We can come back down or we can go north. I'm going to go north. See what's over here. Oh, it's just a dead end. But we will kill these heads of death. Oh, I'm sorry. Heads of fierce. Oh, they don't make new ones of themselves. They make vlats. Which is bats, apparently, in this game. Grave bat. Ooh. <laughs> this way, we already killed a bunch of you. As you can see, we're hell of a high level. Because we're just eating things alive in here. Well, there's another way here. Let's check out this way. Oh, look! A button! That you can use the whip across. 
later on. And you do want to do that. Stabby! Well, there's really not much to talk about at this point in the game. Ooh, you're a runny chest. We need to click that to open the door, which we'll leave alone for now. Please. Oh, magical armor! Huh? Which I believe we already have. But let us continue into the fortress of darkness. Meow, 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 meow. So I've really gotten into this, uh, you know, I'm not the biggest hip-hop fan or rap fan, but I've really got into this uh, Schaefer the Dark Lord, which I have favorited, so if you want to look at my favorite videos, it's one... I, like, down after hearing that video, I, or watching that video, I downloaded the entire album because... I love nerd rappers. They're awesome. Why won't you let me hit you? Ugh. Oh, I'm way over. I will have to pause the video here. I'll see you in the next one. This is Tyrone signing off.